Turning now to our climate and crisis, heat is the leading cause of weather-related deaths in the United States. And a new analysis by Climate Central shows climate change is having a growing influence on the amount of extremely hot summer days in hundreds of cities across the nation. And here to give us more insight is meteorologist Fiona Arana. Hi, Audrey. Hi. And Climate Central takes a look at how climate change itself, but also the human influence, impacts the daytime high of a particular day. And they have an index for this, which shows us how have they gotten hotter? Have we seen less heat? And also a lot of that pollution mainly comes from, of course, things like the burning of fossil fuels, you know? And so let's take a look at this map. So as we look across the U.S., it shows us more extremely hot summer days due to climate change. And where you're seeing the color scale down below, it shows us the change in Avril annual extremely hot summer days made at least two times more likely by climate change. This is dating back all the way to 1970. And if you you look at some of the scales some areas are seeing some of that red which is 20 plus days wow. and almost 88 percent of the 270 stations that they analyze across the entire u.s now let's zoom this in a bit closer here locally san jose if you look we've seen an increase definitely jumping from 2010 all the way up to 2024 and we have managed to see a boost there which of course in inland areas we're a bit more used to seeing the warmth right mm -hmm. what about a place like san francisco where a lot of folks don't have AC or the peninsula. Look at the gradual warming from all the way in the 1990s where we saw kind of one more extreme weather day to now over the span of, you know, several years. We've also seen a lot of this fueled by extreme heat. So to give us more insight on who else saw this impact is here a meteorologist from Climate Central. The western U.S. and cities across the south, especially in Texas, are feeling it the most adding anywhere from a few weeks to nearly a month of extra scorching days, made at least twice as likely due to man-made carbon pollution. And with heat already being the deadliest kind of weather we face, these rising temperatures are a major heat risk for us as we go through the summer months. And with the excitement coming up of the summer, you mm -hmm. know, the kids are out. I want everybody to go outside and enjoy themselves. But uh, take all of those warnings and advisories seriously. Uh, coming up, we're going to talk about what we can expect in the stretch as far as heat in mm -hmm. just a few minutes in the forecast. All right. Looking forward to it, VNA. Thank you.